Hello. In the upcoming video we will get acquainted with the interface of specialized photogrammetry software, namely Reality Capture. The software is designed to create your reference 3D models of various objects, such as buildings, maps, monuments, interiors and more. In other words, in short, a geographical coordinate system of all photos is provided for the purpose of visualization and analysis of information. Let's show you. We open Reality Capture. This is the first window that opens to us, namely, Help menu. It is written in great detail and understandable. As you can see it is not small and here you can go very deep into the functions of the program itself, because we will pay attention only to the main functions. We will give you a foundation on which to build your skills. This is the first button with the software logo. As a basic one, it has functions like most programs. By clicking on it, we can create a new project, open an existing session, save a project we are currently working on, as well as save a project under a specific name. Below are the export button, then the option to export project reports, as well as the share button. On the right side of the panel we have quick access to the latest work. With the exit button we exit the program. The next feature we will pay attention to is this bar. These are different types of visualizations of work windows. You can choose the one that is most convenient for you. These are the three main buttons that combine all the functions of the program. We are currently seeing the workflow toolbar. Let's quickly explain the functions of one of the tools. It is important to note that when you specify a button, a small box appears with information about what function the tool performs, which is quite useful. With the Map Wizard button, scan material can be processed with a drone. The photos that are taken contain metadata about the field, such as distance, angle, altitude, which data can be read by reality capture and used to more accurately model the object. With real-time assistance, you can add an additional scanning device. From the next two buttons we can insert the scan material into the software. From inputs, we select specific or single files, while from folder, we specify a folder with organized material. In the next panel we start with the video sequence. With this feature, you can use video for scan material. With laser scan you insert laser scanned material, with component you insert reality capture components, with ground control you determine the position of the model, etc. You can find out more about the other functions in this panel in the help menu.
The process panel has the main processing functions. If we press the start button directly, the program will automatically start building a model with the scanned material. In align images we arrange the photos and control points. With calculate model you can view the model in different quality during processing. From the simplify tool you can simplify the model to make it lighter. You have the texture of the object as well as the colors. The output panel is clearly clear. From here you export the finished model, you can share it or make a video with the object, as well as a photo. The last panel is for setting up the program itself. Again, options for work windows, general reality capture settings, panels and the help menu itself. On the alignment button we have more detailed functions of the organization of the material, as well as to add criteria and options for 3D modeling. In the mesh model, we also have more processing tools. We often use these features, but we will show you how they work in making the models themselves. These are the most basic functions and buttons of reality capture. In the following lessons we will make 3D models from the material we scan.